you know, I traveled to the West Bank and I mentioned to you offline that I really loved the people there. Just, um, you know, I've met a bunch of people like that in, in Eastern Europe where I grew up. Uh, yeah, like the flamboyant, the big personalities, all of that. Uh, I also met uh, a person who's in charge of a refugee camp who was shop an IDF soldier. And um, I'm not sure the words he said are important as the consequences of the thing that you mentioned, which is the deep hate in his eyes. Mm -hmm. That was, didn't feel repairable at all. It was pain, it was like a foundation of pain and on top of that, a hatred. And it was like, wow, this is what, you kill, you kill one person, this is what you create. Mm -hmm. Because we have kind of like a front row seat to what's happening. We, we think we're in it, but we can't really grasp it. I mean, people's like, oh, we're just gonna go in, get Hamas out, and we're gonna get them back in. Mm -hmm. And what about the people get back in? How do you think they would look at you? What have you created? What have you done? 